What is going on YouTube and Weight Loss Warriors? It's your boy C-Dub and I'm back with another video. And I think this time of year is the hardest time for weight loss. And I'm going to bring you some tips to help you out and get through it right after this. What is going on? My name is C-Dub and if you've never clicked on one of my videos, I lost 125 pounds eating just one time a day. Welcome to my channel. I started this channel to hook you up with tips and tricks to help you on your weight loss journey and knowledge that I learned from my weight loss journey. I appreciate you joining me and to all of my weight loss warriors. Thank you for always being a part of this channel, for clicking on every single video and for supporting me and for helping me finally reach that 3,000 subscriber mark. Let's push it on up to four. I appreciate everybody out there. Thank you so much. Let's hop into today's topic. And the reason I decided to do it today, it's no secret. Here in the United States, we have Thanksgiving. And I think Thanksgiving is the beginning of the end of so many weight loss journeys. And not just that, but worldwide, a lot of people celebrate Christmas or Hanukkah or a, a several other holidays that all fit kind of right into this time frame. And we start to get a little bit kind of off-guided at this time of year. And so I, I want to get us back on track and try to help you out. But I want to start by saying the reason I think it's difficult is because we all generally feel like not good, let's just say crap, let's just call it what it is, right after Thanksgiving. It's just one of those things where we've eaten so much, we've done way more than we should have, we regret the fact that we've done too much, and then on top of regretting the fact that we've done too much, you're just not feeling well and you wake up the next morning and it's like, you know what, I have messed myself up. And you know what, Christmas is right around the corner, it's not going to get any easier, I've got all kinds of things going on, it's a very busy time, all the shopping and all the stuff that I got to do, the decorating and yada yada yada. I just don't have time for it, forget it, I'll start back up in the new year. And that's where we kind of go in a weight loss community and the new year comes and it just doesn't work out. So I want to encourage each one of you to understand that it's never the right thing to be like on the first I'm going to get back on track. On the first of this or next Monday or that mentality is a broken mentality. You got to want to change starting right now and just because you had a bad day yesterday doesn't mean you have to have one today, tomorrow, or the next day. We have to continuously refocus our energy on what needs to be done wherever we're at in our journey. And this is not something that's ever going to really truly go away. I know you guys know that I'm in maintenance, but I'm in the same situation. If I lose track on uh, you know yesterday, I've got to get back on the horse today. So it's just it's a really, really basic and simple thing to understand that we don't have to throw it all away because we've had one bad day or two bad days. But we don't want it to escalate to the end of the year. So what do we got to do? We got to get back to whatever our protocol is. And if you got to work back a little bit slowly into it because maybe you've been off track for a week or maybe you've been off track for a month. Hey, maybe you used to subscribe to this channel and you haven't done it in a while and you're thinking about the new year and you clicked on it. We got to get back on track. We got to get back to fasting. We got to try to get back into the 16 and 8 or better situation all the way down to OMAD like myself. We got to get back into eating the good stuff and staying away from the bad stuff. But more importantly, we have to understand that this is a forever thing, not a thing that's in the moment. And I think that is the number one take from all of this. If you're in the weight loss journey and you're thinking about, well, you know what, I've got a little bit more to go, and yeah, I've lost 40 pounds and I got 10 more to go, but I messed up last night and it's a frustrating time and I'm gonna wait till the new year. Then when you get to the new year, you're gonna put back on another 15 or 20 pounds and you're gonna be back in a tougher situation. It's gonna be harder to start. Or so you had a little hiccup and you've put on a couple of pounds due to this last week. Now is the time to fix it. Go on a little bit of a 48 hour fast and get right back into your fasting protocol. Take it slowly, remember that each and every day that you're out here grinding and getting done the results you need to, you're going to be making it back up quick. Remember, it is just a destination. It's the journey. It's, it's making it through the entire process, day in and day out, and knowing that you're committed and knowing that you have what it takes to make it through to the other side. So I know the video is a little bit on the short side today, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I hope that I've encouraged you to stay with the plan, to get back on your fasting protocol, to do the small things again to get yourself right 
and to get yourself back where you need to be so that we're not waiting until the new year. I know you see my face, it's right there. Click on it, I will help you subscribe to this channel and it's free. But the information I'm giving you is priceless. So I thank you so much. Appreciate you. Thank you for coming to Warrior. Talk to you on the next one. Peace.